guys, welcome back to Daily Duel. So today is a Friday, that means we're using Karkamiro. Uh, there's no Stanzi today, like I said, this whole week, no tag partners. And, um, uh, oh, who's going first, me? Yeah, I'm going first, awesome. I totally don't mind going first. <laughs> and uh, I will be, hopefully, part, this is part three, hopefully finishing my uh, Return to D-Log story and, you know, summarizing all the classes and etc, etc. So I'm gonna try to stay focused. I mean, of course I'm gonna stay focused on Duel, but I'm gonna try to stay focused on uh, on uh, telling you guys, uh, you know, the, the stories, the stories. So I already told you about my education class, and I already told you about my uh, women's literature class. So let's go over to Tuesday and Thursdays where I have two other classes. So uh, the first class that I have, it's, a, it's at 9.30 in the morning to 10.50. Uh, every Tuesday and Thursday, it is women's studies. I know you probably think like you're in women's literature and in women's studies. Yes, uh, uh, the literature thing that that just kind of happened because I needed to take a literature class, and the only time that was open was women's literature. Uh, the women's studies that was kind of intentional, just because I've had friends who took that class and it was easy A, so I need another easy A because for some odd reason for your general, which you know your general leads up into your associate's degree or whatever your thing is. Uh, you have to take three social sciences. So I already took psychology and sociology, so I need one more, and there was like anthropology and other stuff like that, and there was women's studies, and my friends were like, yeah, it was an easy A. You know, uh, so I decided, okay, let's, let's go ahead and do women's studies. So I am in women's studies. So uh, the class actually uh, started in the K building, and the K building was not a building that I generally go to. I think I went to the K building only one time, and only one time was it was like a theater room, and it was before I switched majors. I was actually like in a science major, and they took you into this hall, and they're like, "If you want to be this kind of doctor, if you want to be this kind of nurse," and you know, and we just had a big old conglomerate group of people who want to be in college for the rest of their life up in that room. Well, my classroom was in that room, and it, it looked like a theater. Like literally, you open the door, and it was just you know rows of seats going down at an angle with a big old screen, you know, and it looked like a theater. And, uh, you know, the women's studies teacher, uh, she introduced herself and surprisingly, not surprisingly, uh, my teacher's a feminist, yes, and, you know, some of you guys are thinking, like, oh, feminists, oh, they hate men, they hate men, damn feminists, uh, my teacher's a lesbian, oh, shocker there, are you gonna take your turn, sir, you know, like, I know you gotta think, but you, you kinda just, you know, taking your time, I mean, I don't know why, I, you know, I mean, some people come here to duel, some people here come here to talk, so if we can get a little bit of combination of both, that would be great. If you don't, then, uh, go ahead and end your turn, and I will go ahead and take my turn, and you guys, that seems like you don't want to play the yugi Mons, and I don't mind you not wanting to play the yugi Mons. so I'm just gonna go ahead and summon Bear. Bear's just gonna hit you directly, if you don't want to play, I'll just, I'll just play by myself, fine. I'm gonna attack you directly. Yeah. Take this. Hell yeah. Woo. I'm getting it in, guys. You better watch out. Look at me go. Look at my form. Is it tanky? Yes. Uh, give me a wolf bark. Woo. I'm kicking butt taking names. Look at this. Look at me go. Go ahead. So... Uh, when class is in the big theater room, um, I got to class on the first day a little bit early, so, you know, knowing me, I decided to go ahead and scout, and by scout, I mean, look and see if there's any cute girls that I want to flirt with, because I'm like that. So, uh, there's some, some cute girls, there's some ugly girls, there's some fat girls, and uh, all different kind of ranges of girls, and definitely outnumbered in that class, too. I think it's like, I think it's like 5 to 25 in that class, so... Yeah, the ratio is lots of girls, though. It uh, doesn't look like this person wants a duel, so I guess I'll go ahead and get a duel and bear back. All right, another duel. So, uh, the first day, I go talk to this girl that I just, I don't know, I decided to go ahead and talk to her because I, I thought, I don't know what I thought. I really, I didn't know what I thought, but I decided to go and talk to her. Ew, this hand's kind of gross. <laughs> yeah, it's actually kind of gross. Eh, I'll take it slow. I can take the door slow. Unless he just flat out OTKs me. I mean, if he OTKs me, then GG, man, but, no. 
I should be able to take a slow punt. Safe zone. Ugh, I knew it. As soon as I saw punt, I'm like, I'm probably going up against Bujins. Bujin bitches. I haven't seen that deck in a cool minute. Getting warning. That's fine. Set warning. Set some more. Set some more. Set some more. Some Yamato. Yep. Ooh, it's like it's like I know exactly what you're going to do. My hand is still kind of just ass like. And going against Bujin doesn't help either. Yep, you're gonna get Crane. You're probably gonna drop hair, yep. Well, I mean, you opened up fine. I, of course, I run Zen mains in here, right? Yes, I do. So I'll probably do that play. So, go ahead and block with hair. Mm-hmm. Your guy. Yes. Your guy, I'm into her bus. Go ahead and make his admins. I'm gonna ram into him. I don't care if he drops the crane, and then during then phase, I'm just gonna pop him. So. Hopefully he won't have another Yamato in his hand. If he does, then just fuck. <laughs> you wanna play Crane? No? no? Of course I'll activate the Ninja Fight. Test until I died. And I will just end. It's kinda of convoluted play there, but I got it done. Mika, alright. I'm glad he opened up well. I said I opened up pretty ass here. Anyway. Yeah, this girl. First day I talked to. Didn't really seem interested. It didn't really get click, so. I moved on, like usual. Uh, there's one particular girl in the class, and she is, like, super, super cute. Like, super cute. But I really think that she's out of my league. I, and I really can't build up the courage to talk to her, because she just seems like she's way out of my league. But, I don't know, at this point, I might as well try. And then there was this other girl, uh, let's call her, let's call her Kirby Girl, because she likes Kirby. We actually, you know, we're actually talking about how awesome Kirby is. Uh, she had a Kirby shirt on, so we just started talking about Kirby, Kirby the character, you know, Super Smash Bros. Kirby the character. Uh, so, uh, you know, we talked about, uh, she's like, oh, I really like Air Ride, and, you know, we started talking about how underrated Kirby Air Ride is as a game, and how awesome it is a, as a game. But, okay. I thought you were going to maybe summon your crane and make, like, a Castella 101 and get rid of my Zen mains, but you're like, no, nah, I'll just pot. Alright, well, at least I don't have to worry about you doing anything like that this turn. You gotta worry about you ponding right into another Yamato though, which you'll probably do. I have no response, sir. I don't know why you're waiting for so long. What's up with everybody today? So, uh... I, I was actually planning on talking to this girl for like a cool minute. Are you gonna get the effect veiler and then summon it and then make a uh, Amides? That would suck. <laughs> Cause I have like nothing to face Amides in my hand right now. Yeah, looks like you're probably gonna do that. Get the effect veiler, summon effect veiler, make it a mighty and run my ass over. No, you're gonna go for a Oh, you can't XA anyway. Okay, you summon crane and Oh, uh, you're just gonna attack me twice, yeah, that works. Uh
Actually, I should have craned. Uh, I'm gonna crane. Actually, I'm gonna lance you, and I'm gonna get hit by you. Cause I can run you over. Hell no, my tour guide back. <laughs> like, you want to return your model? Like, what? No. <laughs> In phase, I'm gonna go ahead and pop Mika. Oh, Crusader. Okay. So what do you need to do? Okay. I forgot, what did he pot into his hand? Valor, Valor. That's right, Valor. What the fuck did he add with pot? I can't remember. <laughs> Alright, so these two, I'm assuming they're back row and they're dead. You got a Valor in your hand, you have a crane on the field. There's no point in Valor, man. I'm not even gonna activate my effect. And even if I was, you could still Valor. I'm not really worried about that. Because again, going against Bujin bitches, the worst thing that I gotta worry about is him top decking to his Zenmin, so. I mean, Zen means, uh, Yamato. So, uh, I was planning out this attack for a while now. Uh, I was actually planning on, uh, sitting next to her, near her, you know, talking to her on, uh, on, uh, Tuesday, but I walked in class late and I was kind of flustered. Everybody was looking at me. I was like, fine, I'll just sit down. You know, I didn't really have time to plan out my attack. Nice top deck, Yu-Gi-Oh! Do -do -do. That's fine. Oh, there. Nice top deck. <sighs> so, Thursday. I, you know, sat next to her. Uh, we really didn't talk in class, but, you know. Uh, she had her bag on the... On the I, I tried to make small talk, like, you know, we had an assignment to turn in, so I was like, oh, did she already collect the assignment? She was like, oh, yeah, yeah, she, the teacher did. And uh, at the end of class, I, you know, I asked her to move her bag so I could sit. Uh, and uh, she moved her bag. At the end of the class, I was like, oh, you know, sorry for inconveniencing you. You know, I know you wanted to kind of put your bag there, and, you know, I'm sitting next to you. Everybody everybody else is sitting in every other seat yet. You know, I'm sitting next to you. So, uh, I guess you're going to top deck into Yamato, right? It's about time you top deck into Yamato. Right? You're just going to go with Yamato. And I'll be like, alright. Ah, no Yamato. This guy, it's not drawing that hot. I'm drawing hot. I drew bear. So I'm drawing pretty hot right now. <laughs> ah, you see this is the fun. It's funny. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Nudge, nudge. Anyway. Would you draw into another effect really you want to throw at me? Uh, nope, you're just gonna quit. Alright, let's get another duel in. Be right back. Alright, another duel. So, I uh, decided to, despite me uh, having the chance of... Who's going first? You or me? Me, okay. Well, despite uh, me having a chance of uh, being late to class, I actually decided to... I'm actually gonna set this. Uh, decided to walk her to class. Uh, her birthday is actually on September 11th, and you know that's next Thursday. But uh, you know, we actually talked about how we were kind of talking about how her birthday was on September 11th, and you know how you know she was actually six when the day happened. For those of you who don't live in America, you probably don't know what I'm talking about. But yeah, put yourself back. <laughs> this effect is mandatory. Oh, except for tour bus. I did not read that. I thought you could send yourself. And I guess then you'd be looping yourself, right? That's not healthy. Oh well. All right, let's go ahead and I mean, let's go ahead and get there. There, throw a chair attack directly. You won't get your shining angel effect. No complaints there. Give me another tanky. Expect the dual slow. So I charge you, no effect, hit you directly for 16. Go ahead and get my fate. Go ahead and grab me another tanky, set that. Main phase 2, set this royal decree and pass to you. 
so uh, I ended up walking her in class. I thought I was doing really fine, and uh, so she revealed that she has a boyfriend. So there we go. So guess I'm not running with her anymore now. I don't want to step on any toes. I'm not that kind of guy who would be like, Mr. Steal Your Girl. I've never been like that, so. Oh, that's cute. Is there any dim step you, you'll gain? 300 attack. That's cute. That's cute. That's one way to run over my bear. But I can take the duel slow. Yup. Yep. Where the hell are my iron cores? Like, I haven't been getting any iron cores all duel. Okay. So we'll go ahead and make my boss monster. Tiger! Yes, Tiger. Go ahead and set me another tanky. And we'll just run over this Zwei? Is that Zwei or Dry? Zwei, alright. So, uh, I guess I won't be flirting with her anymore, so... I guess at, the, at this point, I might as well just go ahead and try to talk to the girl who's super cute and way out of my league, even though I think she either A, has a boyfriend, or B, is not interested, but yeah. There's no harm in trying, right? <laughs> so... Usually I don't like having all my eggs in one basket, but it's starting to turn like turn out wow. Well, Alright, you know, I don't have enough time for another duel. But it's starting to turn out that uh all I'm about to have all my eggs in one basket because the first girl that I was flirting with, of course, uh you know I, I mean I'll i I'll keep trying, but you know, I don't like it that she kinda like just disappeared. Like I said, if she doesn't want to be bothered with bothered with me, then I'd rather her tell me than, you know, try to avoid me. No, because it, that it just makes it awkward for both of us to say, you know what, you're a nice guy, not interested, I don't want to be your friend, and instead of trying to avoid me, because then that just makes shit awkward. So, I mean, I guess I'll, I'll you know, I'll see her on Monday, you know, I can be like, you know, where'd you go, well, you know, what's up? But, uh, yeah, um, then, of course, we have uh, Movie Girl, which is pretty much where I'm putting all my eggs in one basket, so, pretty much, if I get rejected by her, you know, at that point, I be almost three weeks in and head on and shit's not going right for me, no surprise there. Uh, you know, uh, uh, Kirby girl, she has a boyfriend, so not her. And then, uh, and out of my league girl. So, I guess I might as well try and talk and flirt with out of my league girl. But, at this point, I'm running out of classes. Oh, and let me quickly just talk about calculus class. Calculus class, I'm so busy with calculus that I'm not even going to try to flirt with any girls. Like, it's literally, there's no time to flirt. There's no time. That I gotta work. And then, been in class, two hours long, every Tuesday and Thursday, work, 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 calculus, calculus, problems, taking like a half a page of work. By the time class is over, I'm exhausted mentally. Mentally, I'm just like, oh, my head hurts. So, because so much, and my hand hurts from writing all that much. So, I'm trying to focus on calculus. I'm not going to flirt with any girls. There's some cute girls in the class mostly guys though but there are some cute handful of girls uh mostly asian that's not racist at all but uh no nah. i'm gonna try to flirt with any girls in calculus class yeah you guys probably think you're like well uh what about that one girl in the last calculus class that was different i had a much easier teacher i had a teacher who pretty much wasn't even trying to teach you know in this calculus class i actually have a good teacher i like the teacher uh the class is pretty good uh the workload is okay you know uh, each week we get like 25 math problems to do, do in a week, so I just go ahead and get started. Sometimes I actually do them in class because, you know, we'll do like problems on the board as a class and I'll bust them out real quick and, you know, we have to wait for everybody to get done, then wait for the teacher to go over them on the board. I look up, I got the correct answer, so I'll actually, in the middle of class, whip out my math book and do my math homework in the middle of class to keep me entertained because if I don't keep myself entertained I will get bored and when I get bored I start messing with people like I, I wasn't doing my math homework and I got bored and it, it was actually one of my friends I actually like pushed his paper off to the desk and I was just really bored so I said to uh, go ahead and uh, start doing my math homework and keep myself focused because if I don't I become like I'm 12 <laughs> so yeah those are all my classes so now I should uh, 
be uh, be able to just tell you day by day. I shouldn't be able to keep up and tell you guys day by day. Uh, as you guys know, uh, the tag partners are being reduced down from four to two while you know school is in session. So uh, you know that video is up. I believe Tuesday I'm going to be taking it down, and that will determine uh, who will be joining me. Uh, the two tag partners, but just because you know two of the two tag partners won't be joining me on daily duels for tag series anymore, doesn't mean they can't join me for other things. They can still join me for DM duel commentary. They can still join me for vitamin Y. It's just you know they won't have a tag day anymore. You know until uh, I get another break where you know I'm not doing much. But you know back in college, you guys want to hear about my life. Some of you guys come here to hear about my life. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and call that an episode. So. uh yeah, so I will see you guys tomorrow using uh, Heraldics, once again by myself, no tag partners, so no make chaos. So, uh, yeah, so thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Uh, thanks for watching.